What's up, everybody? Welcome to the second episode of the MLK Library Tours. Right when you arrive at the second floor, you'll notice that it's home to the Jennifer and Philip DiNapoli Gallery. The gallery features exhibits that rotate every three to four months. The current exhibit, entitled Lowrider Photography by Susan Lopez, is in conjunction with the exhibit on the fifth floor, Story and King, San Jose's Lowrider Culture. Aside from the gallery, the second floor also hosts the topographical collection with a wide variety of maps, atlases, and almanacs. In addition, the second floor has quite a few of those secrets by Mel Chin I had mentioned in the previous video. When you first walk up the escalators, you might notice an LED screen embedded into the wall. If you take a closer look, you'll see that there are actually inscriptions carved into the glass. This piece, entitled Rosetta, is a tribute to the Rosetta Stone. The second floor also has numerous study spaces. If you take a look at some of the chairs, you might notice that some are leather. If you look even closer, you'll see that there's actually a branding in them. These are actually cattle brands that were used in the original San Jose Ranchos. In the northeast corner of the library, there's a reading alcove that has a hearth or a fireplace. If you take a closer look though, there's actually books inside the fireplace. The piece, entitled Hearth, is simple, but its message is powerful. Though books may be burned and pages may be torn, the ideas within them are forever. And on that note, I'd like to conclude the second floor tour. Thanks for watching.